Hello and welcome to What We Watched. Uh, I was at a music festival all day and so I was intentionally trying to stay off of YouTube because today is Saturday and more importantly than Saturday, today is Comic-Con Saturday. For those who don't know, this is probably one of the biggest, nerdiest days of the year where trailers are announced, new movies are announced, comic books, action figures, all that sort of stuff. So we had a lot happening today, and one of the first things that we want to talk about is there was a brand new Justice League trailer that dropped today, and I intentionally, like I said, stayed off of YouTube. I wanted to wait until I got home uh, in the late hours of Saturday to watch it for the first time and give you guys my initial thoughts. So that is what we are going to do. So here we go. Bat signal. All right, that was a little teaser at the beginning. Assuming these are bad guys. I hope. Oof. Wonder Woman, everyone's favorite Justice League member at the moment. What did you do this weekend, Diana? Me? Huh. Nothing very interesting. Hmm. The world remains in mourning after the death of the Superman. Okay, so they're playing off the whole Superman death thing. They said the age of heroes will never come again. It has to. We don't have any more time. Okay, so we got mother boxes, and it appears to involve Amazon. I'm assuming that's Stephen Wolf. There we have Aquaman, Wonder Woman, Cyborg. No Kryptonian. This world will fall. Like all the others. One misses the days when one's biggest concerns were exploding wind-up penguins. <laughs> this is crazy. Honestly, I think we're all gonna die. <laughs> Each of us, in some way, is held back. Don't engage alone. We'll do this together. It's really cool. You guys seem ready to do battle and stuff, but I've never done battle. I just pushed some people in my way. <laughs> Relax, Alfred. I'll take it from here. Uh, d do I know you? Superman was a beacon to the world. He didn't just save people. He made them see the best parts of themselves. All right. I don't recognize this world. We don't have to recognize him. We just have to save it. Oh, wow, they just, they really just vanished. <laughs> huh? Oh, that's rude. <laughs> that's funny. You said you'd come. Now let's 
hope you're not too late. All right. So they're hinting that there's another member of the Justice League, obviously, at the very end there. That's either going to be Superman coming back, maybe Green Lantern, or maybe just... My guess would be Superman coming back, um, and that's going to kind of tip the scales at the very end of the movie. One of the things I really liked, just right off the top of my head, about this trailer was seeing how much they worked together. There was a lot of shots where it was uh, Flash throwing the sword to Wonder Woman, or, um, you know, the whole iconic scene now of Aquaman on the top of the Batmobile. That whole idea of them working together, that was actually one of my favorite parts about the fight scene in Batman v Superman Dawn of Justice, was the fact that everyone was kind of involved in beating Doomsday. Uh, you had Batman who shot the gun to let the kryptonite gas off. You had Wonder Woman with the lasso, and you had... Superman with the final stab. So I really like how they have that whole thing of it's not, okay, I'm going to fight you for a little bit and then get knocked away and then someone else is going to fight you, but this genuine team up. And so I'm really excited. I thought that was great. Uh, it gave you a lot of story. Um, it showed you who the villain was, but we kind of already knew who the villain was. Um, but it gave you a good look at him without completely revealing maybe what his idea is. It gave you a lot of hints showing you things like mother boxes. And um, I just really am excited about how they're bringing all of these uh, characters together. Um, I am a little bit curious how they're going to do uh, both Flash and Aquaman and kind of introducing two brand new characters um, without introducing them really a lot beforehand. We've seen Batman and we've seen Wonder Woman in action, so you don't need to give them a lot of backstory. And then also Cyborg, he's also there too. So you have a lot of new moving parts, and I'm kind of curious to see how that's all going to come together. But my initial reaction, uh, just on my first watching of it, is that this is going to be a fun movie. Uh, I actually really did enjoy Batman v Superman. Um, I didn't think it was phenomenal, but I did really enjoy it. And I think that this is going to be even better. So what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments down below. Are you excited about this movie? Uh, what other things that happened today at Comic-Con are you excited about? Let me know in the comments down below. Um, also, be sure to like, share, and subscribe uh, to this video and to this channel. Be sure to uh, hit us up on Instagram or like us on Facebook. Once again, I am Matt from What We Watched, and thanks for watching.